Oh boy! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, today's gonna be super cool. Now we actually got Christian coming into work and I told him to bring his race quad. Oh, here he comes, there he is. <laughs> Cause today we are getting a new unit. But the quad god has arrived. The quad god? The quad god has arrived. Well, uh, you know why I asked you to bring your bike? You're buying one. Maybe. I, you wouldn't have asked me to bring my bike unless you were buying one. <laughs> I want to test drive yours, okay? I need to ride it first. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. All right. Once you ride it, just don't blow it up. Yeah? So as you guys know, Christian and Miller, they started buying these uh, these race quads. This is a TRX 450, ain't it? 2013, yep. 2013? Yeah, is it quick? Ah, you rode it. Yeah. You know how quick yeah, it is. Yeah, it's pretty quick. <laughs> when Christian first bought it, I did ride it before he ever touched it. It gets up and goes. Big ramp guy, eh? Huge ramp guy. Huge ramp guy. But well, this thing is extremely loud. It's pretty quick. And I know everybody's been wanting me to get a race quad for the longest time. So uh, we're going to ride this thing around and uh, I might have something lined up for us later today. I know whenever you go to buy something like this, you yeah. don't surprise me because you always act a little like, I don't know, you just act a certain <laughs> way. You have this act going on. <laughs> I just know when you're up to something. And there'd be no other reason for me to bring this here Yeah. if it wasn't for you getting one today. Yeah. So, But I'll tell you what, if you try to outdo me today, and get oh, a yeah? Raptor, Raptor 700, <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed. Why would you be upset if I got a Raptor 700? Because realistically, that's the one that I wanted. Yeah, why is that? But it wasn't in the price range. Yeah, okay? why is that? Well, because they have reverse. They have reverse? This one doesn't. <laughs> Yeah, Christian was kind of onto my shenanigans when I was texting him last night telling me he needs to bring it. Let's get that thing off the truck. I'm excited to ride it. I'm, I might outside. break it. Please don't break it. Hey, are these things lined up, man? Yeah, 100%. I hope so. I didn't really look. Are you on? Uh, I think so. Think so? There it is. Woo! Probably need to get that thing warming up. Yeah, probably. Let's hear it. First start up. There it is. There you go. We're gonna let that thing get warmed up and uh, I'm gonna go take it for a rip. Christian's in for quite the surprise today and I think you guys are too. It's gonna be a good day. I'm, I'm stoked, I'm pumped. Not my grass, Christian. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's loud. That's ridiculous. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead, get on the helmet, slap on the GoPro and we're gonna go rip this thing. Oh man, BP on a race quad. Now I've only drove one of these for like 10 minutes before so uh, should be interesting. If I can figure out how to start it. Don't wreck it. Don't wreck it? No promises. Don't blow it up. He said don't blow it up. <laughs> what does he think this is? Oh my gosh. Yep, she rips. I bet in the wet grass it'd get away from you. Let's see. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's just spinning. This is like a pit wheeler on steroids, bro. Yeah, it's just straight up spinning. That is ridiculous. Buddy needs some new tires. Woo Shit, she comes out quick. When she decides she wants to come out, she comes out. Oh yeah. That is uh, really slick. Like you don't have to hit the throttle that much with this thing spinning. I thought I hit that bird. Anyone else see that? Like, I feel like a Can-Am Outlander would be faster than this, but at the same time, this just feels more reckless. Maybe I'm just not used to it. This thing does just get after it, though. My goodness. It rolls, bro. So you said you broke the wheelie bar off, right? Yeah. What happens if I go too far back and clap the exhaust? The exhaust held up. Have you done it? Well, it's going to pack the exhaust with dirt. We'll blow it out. See if we can't do a little wheelie sesh. I want to see if I can slow wheelie this thing. It's just spinning. There's no traction. There's nothing there. We're going to have to go to the concrete. Suspension seems pretty good, but also at the same time reckless. Like I said, I've never drove one of these, so. Yep. Woo! Going towards the mailbox. I just want to get like a good, good wheelie in. Woo! That's weird. Going that slow, you have to pull in that clutch. It's like a 450 dirt bike, except four wheels, which is even scarier. It's so wet. It's supposed to clear up later today and be blue skies, but this morning, man, it's just, it's ugly out. <laughs> it is way too slick. It's like a drift car almost. I mean, there's just no traction. 
<laughs> I definitely feel like I'm gonna roll this thing. Take it back down through the woods, see how it is in the trail. Get a little stand-up action going. Hope I don't clap a tree. I know people GNC race these things. We haven't been down these trails in forever. They're a little on the grown-up side. I obviously I'm not familiar with this thing, but I, I could wax this on an Outlander all day. Those KMs are hard to beat, man. And you'd have four-wheel drive, which would uh definitely help because this thing gets no traction. Up, oh, trees down in the trail. Suspension's good. Good to know. But like I said, we're buying a new unit today and Christian's really has no clue what it is. And you guys also have no clue what it is, but uh, it's gonna be pretty funny. I'm I'm ready to show this thing to him. It's got the freaking nicest shocks, bro. Like it's just, it's, it's kind of overkill. It's ridiculous. I mean, the thing's gonna rip. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh my gosh. This thing does scoot, son. It just feels like a, a death trap, though. At least on an Outlander, when you're pushing this much power, you feel it's a lot more uh, controllable in a way. I did take it up and down the road when he first got it, but I didn't really rip on it. I ripped on it on pavement, but I feel like off-road, it's a different story. <laughs> Shifting gears, unlike a Can-Am, is fun, though. I'd give it that. I just wish this clutch wasn't so stiff. And it's funny because people are like, oh yeah, you got weak hands. No, it's just annoying. Oh my gosh. Look out, I mean, it's just no throttle, just that slick. This thing, I mean, it'd rip your arms off if it had four wheel drive. I could not jump one of these things. It's so funny. Like, I'm, I'm a trail riding kind of guy when it comes to dirt bikes. Like, just ripping in the woods, virgin woods, hill climbs, all extreme enduro type stuff. And it's like track people, they're like, oh, no, I'd never do that. That's dangerous as hell. And then the guys in the woods are like, no, nah, I'd never jump, hit those motocross tracks. That's dangerous as hell. And it's so funny how it kind of goes both ways. But, like, quad guys are kind of left out of that conversation. Quad guys definitely get called pussies a lot. But uh, this is uh, very foreign to me. I do not feel feel good on it. Let's just do a second gear dig. Took forever to get traction, but when it did, it freaking took off, boy. Woo oh my god, this is way too fast. Holy crap. Yeah, that second gear digs where it was at, son. But what I do know about these things when it comes to like GNCC racing these things, they're just broken all the time. They can't take the abuse a dirt bike can. But if Miller and Christian has one, maybe old BP needs to pick one up. This is four. But this is so much lighter than a Can-Am too. This bike weighs nothing compared to a big heavy Can-Am. The Can-Am does put out more power though. This thing's intense. Oh, the neighbors are pissed. Do you see why I said this thing was so loud? It is obnoxiously loud. Yeah, the neighbors are definitely on the phone with the cops right now. Can you take it in the trails back there? Yeah. I liked it in the trails more than anywhere else because I felt like I'd be able to get more traction in scenarios. This wet grass, there's nothing. It's supposed to dry up later today, like the sun's supposed to come out. So maybe I need to wait till then to rip it more. Just so freaking slippery, man. I'm gonna throw this thing in the garage real quick. I gotta keep uh, pestering Christian a little bit. This is funny. Christian, okay, look. How much fun did you have on it? I don't know. I felt very reckless on it. It's a little reckless. It's, it's little very reckless. reckless. Yeah, I think we need new tires to hook more. Definitely, definitely. And probably not ride it when it's wet outside yeah i don't understand the track guys going and jumping these things i could I, see gnc in the woods bro, but at that rate i'm just riding a can-am i've tried to jump it one time yeah and i came off like i was in air like this really yeah like front <laughs> one time <laughs> it was bad really bad so what, what do you mind i'm telling you it's top of the line is it it's top of the line what do you think it is? You're really gonna go buy a brand new one? Yeah, it's brand new. Really? Top of the line. Is it what I think it is or no? What do you think it is? I think it's a Raptor 700. Yeah? Because those are like big dog stats. Yeah, big dog stats. And you like doing big dog stats <laughs> stuff. So. <laughs> That's why I think that it's a Raptor 700. Okay, okay. You're gonna be pissed when we get there though and you see it. Really? You're gonna be real mad. In a good way or bad way? I don't know. Depends on how you take it. But look, we gotta ride them later today. We gotta go for a rip ski. Well, I figured that's why I brought my quad. Uh-huh. Here or at the new property? The new property. Oh, I do want to rip the trails over there. Okay, yeah, That'd we definitely- That'd be so much fun. For sure. We're gonna let this weather clear up and uh, we're gonna go get this thing. So uh, stay tuned. We're actually gonna be taking my dad's truck. We gotta steal it because my truck is in the shop. We got the crappy little trailer on here. This is gonna be dope. I am so excited to see Christian's reaction. You're gonna be mad. I'm like happy for you, kinda, <laughs> but I'm 
a little bit upset <laughs> that you're about to one up me. Yeah. Like you always do. Every <laughs> single time. Throw the money in the truck. Get this thing fired up. And let's roll. You got any last words? Because next time we pick up the camera, we're going to be at the dealership to look at this thing. We're going to be quad gods. Quad gods? Quad gods. Together? Together. We're going to be quad gods. <laughs> I'm excited about that. I was telling Christian, this thing's got the best suspension on the market. Top of the line, baby. It's going to be so fast. This is going to be great. We'll just pick you guys up once we make it to the dealership. All right, guys, we are five minutes out from the dealership. I'm pumped. Like, I'm super excited about this. This is something that I've been wanting for quite a while now. Christian? I got mixed emotions right now. You dude. got mixed emotions? Yeah, I've been sitting in this truck for an hour to see you basically shit on me. You, you told me the price, uh -huh. and I think I know what it is. I'm like 95% well, sure. What do you think it is? A Raptor 700. Uh, it's got to be. Uh, 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 but I, the thing is, it's like you're a Honda guy. So did you get a Honda? Uh, I don't know. It might be red. Is this thing, is it brand new or is it built out? It's brand new, yes. I can't wait to see her reaction. This is gonna be so funny. Now, I'm really excited to take this thing to the new property because the new property, it needs this. It needs it bad. It needs us to ride it over there, 100%. All right, guys, we're coming up on the dealership. It should be right up here on the left. What you think, buddy? Think this, this, it yeah, says this Honda. Is. Honda? You bought a Honda? No way. <laughs> you better have got a 450 at least. Come on now. They got Kawasaki too. I don't see any four wheelers out front though. Let's go see if we can't find this thing. You want to do the honors and walk in first? Sure. <laughs> Where's the four wheelers? You're joking. That thing's sick, ain't it? What'd you think, Christian? That's not a four-wheeler. Yeah. That's not a quad. It, it is four wheels. It's four wheels, two-wheel drive. I'll, I'll race you in the trails. Like, you ain't got nothing on that. I brought my quad to work today. Excited <laughs> that we were going to ride together today. Yeah? And you bring me to a freaking place to buy a Bro, lawnmower. look at that thing. That's that not, not a race quad. <laughs> this thing is sick. This is the first time I'm seeing it. So it's not the race quad I fooled everybody that it was gonna be. But look, dude, it's a zero turn with shocks. Independent suspension, front and rear. That is badass. I'm still pissed. I was so excited Bro. that you were gonna get a freaking race quad. <laughs> And you did it! We needed a lawnmower for the new property. We got like four acres of grass over there needing mode. I don't have a lawnmower. So now we got one. It's bad to the bone, ain't it? I mean, it's a cool lawnmower, yeah. It's not even a Honda, it's a Ferris wheel. Or whatever, Ferris. Ferris, okay. Ferris wheel. Top of the line. J just sit on it. I don't even Dude, you might change your opinion once you sit on it. Oh, wow, it is nice. Yeah, it is nice, ain't it? It's freaking dude, ripping, dude. Dude, suspension in the seat? Yeah, look at those shocks working, dude. Maybe I'm a little bit more happy for you. Yeah, I appreciate it. Dude, I've been I've been needing one of these for so long and uh, today we're gonna go to the new property and start cutting some grass because it is springtime, it's turkey season, grass is growing, it's green out and uh, it's getting very tall very fast so uh, we needed a good lawnmower. And this thing actually cost an arm and a leg. I could not believe how much lawnmowers cost. But I'm gonna go ahead, go inside, get all the paperwork filled out. Christian, you wanna montage the new unit? I'm gonna drive it into the intersection and then just <laughs> leave it right there. I'm so mad. <laughs> I want a ferret. Get it on the trailer. The red ferret. The way I look at it, I shouldn't have to buy a lawnmower for another 10 or 15 years. So we're gonna take care of it. You hear me? You talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking to you. Well, you act like I'm cutting the grass. I'm <laughs> cutting the grass. Who's gonna cut it then? I hope it fits. It's a 61 inch deck and the trailer on the inside's 62 inch. a little tight. You're scraping. Am I? Pretty much, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're roughing up the both sides. All right, boys, I'm gonna put this last strap on. We can go cut some grass. Oh, guys, so we've made it to the new property. As you guys can tell, the grass has grown up tall. Now we have all of this to mow, all of this all over here, this whole hill, even down there around the ponds. Now we were gonna come straight here and mow, but then it got dark and then it rained for three days straight. And today is the first day we've seen sun. So this thing's probably getting stuck today. But check it out. This thing is absolutely sick. It's got independent suspension all the way 
way around it. When I was actually looking at buying this thing, it started off with like a low end mower, then it went to like a mid, and then I was like, screw it, let's just go high. A mower is something you don't really buy that often. You need to buy one, use it for 10, 12 years, and maybe get another. So hopefully this thing holds up and lasts. Definitely need to mount a light bar right there on that roll bar. So not only does it have independent suspension all the way around, it does have an air ride seat. It's a 61 inch deck. The 70 was gonna be like another eight grand, which was ridiculous. So I said the 60 will do me just fine. Now without further ado, since the sun's coming out, let's hop on this bad boy and get to mowing. How's that race squad, man? Dude, the suspension is downright ridiculous. Thing rips, doesn't it? Big, bro, I'm telling you, you can just watch the shocks work. Yeah, no, <laughs> I was seeing you out there, man. I think you might have some comp. That TRX stands nothing, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, I wish we would have got one before we let everything get like, I don't know, knee high, Dude. but uh, it chugged right through it, it looked like. It did pretty good. Yeah, it did, it pretty did good. really good. We got stuck once. I mean, it, it handled great. <laughs> That's a uh, badass mower right there. Christian, what you think? Well, I've yet to, to try it, but yeah. it couldn't be anything compared to the quad. Uh, I don't know, dude. I'm pretty sure this thing will pop a way better wheelie. I am still a little bit upset, but I'm glad you got a mower <laughs> to take care of the property. So. It was getting pretty bad over here. Pretty freaking bad. Pretty bad. But uh, my ass is sweaty. This is just splendid. Shouldn't have let it get so tall, but man, as soon as springtime hit, this stuff just started growing. Obviously, there's a lot of weed eating around that needs to get done, and we're probably going to go over it with that mower one more time tomorrow to really uh, get it right. But then it's just going to grow right back. It's just going to be a once a week, twice a week routine. It's going to be ridiculous. But it had to be done. I don't know. Maybe a sport quad next or something? You better. Yeah? The time you go to surprise me, it better not be a lawnmower. <laughs> <laughs> Things freaking sick. But if you guys would, smash that thumbs up button. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed today's video. Uh, little twist on things. It's not a four-wheeler. It is a four-wheeler, but not a four-wheeler. If you guys would, like, subscribe, and we'll catch y'all on the next one. Woo!